Okay, so I'm at this event here at Springfield Town Library, and I'm going to turn it over to them now. visiting a meeting called Lifelong, which is basically a, which is basically a meeting about everyone teaching stuff, so yeah. Practice it enough, you can almost do it in your sleep and just kind of roll it right up. 
you know, get nervous and have to look at your cheat sheet, and you know, your good notes or whatever, and, and, and refer to anything, you know your material, and you're comfortable with it. Plus, that also shows everybody how much you love what you're teaching mm -hmm. about. The good thing is recording yourself and playing it back to yourself so you can see what, right. you're, yeah. what you're doing incorrectly and correct what you see for yourself. I did that recently. I was trying to learn some ASL. And so I was just practicing. But then I was like, well, I can't really see truly what I'm doing. And do I look? Does it make sense? And so I recorded myself so I could see. It does make me a little extra nervous. But, <laughs> but it does help. And I think, again, just actually going and taking time to go through your whole presentation, practice what you're going to say. Practice like you're giving it. Um, and again, it's a practice for the Ask a friend or a family member to sit and listen to you, and then they can tell you what they do also. We're doing it in front of the mirror. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and then something to help slow down your speech, help you articulate a little bit better, um, is practicing If you guys are new so to this channel, um, I want to put a link in the description about me moving to Canada. So, like I said, I will be putting a link to the video in the description about why I'm moving to Canada. So, yeah. I did 
find that there's a bunch of other ones. And there was a study done by Harvard, so it was real official. And the hardest, I shouldn't put it on here, but there's a study done on the hardest tongue twister. And it's something about wristwatches and witches. Oh, that's all I can Oh, I, I think I know that one. I think I don't hear you know one. Um, all right. Did everyone practice if Peter Piper picked the pipe? Peter Piper. No? No one else wants to try out? All right. Let's try the next one. A flea and a fly flew up in a flu. A flea and a fly flew up in a flu. A flea and a fly flew up in a flu. That's it for this video. Make sure to like and subscribe and click on the bell for notifications. I'm Lance Robinson, known as Lance Robinson TV, and you are not. I'll see you in the next video.